Welcome to another rant. This one's about greeners. Here we go. G greeners stink. Th the end. Do you like what you see? Want to help me in making video? Okay, so here's the deal about greening, right? Everybody's already spoke their mind about their opinions on greening and how they feel about it. But I've had more than a fair share of people that have come to me and asked me to do a greening rant. And I like the idea, but I didn't want to do it and just refute points that other people have already said time and time again. This isn't some American news channel, water is wet, let's move on to the Kardashians level discussion. I want to actually speak my own mind on the subject, despite how similar it probably is to what other people have really said. That being out of the way, let's get started! So, greeners, they, uh... They aren't fun. Greeners are essentially there to do one thing, and that's to ruin any kind of a semblance of a good time you might have had. Greeners, in my opinion at heart, do it solely because they seek pleasure or satisfaction out of seeing other people go through a rough time, a struggle, or lose progress all entirely. These people decide to take time out of their day, hours even, just to seek out random people, usually tunes that are much more susceptible to getting affected from this, and they seek to cause problems to them. They've got a twisted sense of humor, they're the type of people that enjoy themselves and laugh at the misfortune of other people. Now that's not very toony. These people are worse than cogs. They're anti-tunes, evil tunes who are out to further the damage done by evil cogs. That's not even the complete bad part. It's that half the time you don't even know when you've got a greener with you. You get into a VP lobby and you look around and you're just like, oh good, look at this extremely handsome and super strong tune. There's no way we can possibly lose. Next thing you know, you're going sad. Let me follow this up by clarifying that yes, not all greening is quite exactly like this. There's people out there who green solely because of bad strategy or low laugh or any kind of discrimination and things that they just don't like, and I'm not a fan of this idea. To me, bad strategy and low laugh or gags is annoying, that's a given, but greening people and actively ruining their experience for them is not something I want to do, nor something I would promote. I'll be honest, I'm that guy that keeps the tunes alive if they're facing greening like this, I'll use my Cogmas SOS's and my tune-ups and focus on keeping these people alive. To me, these people are just people that are either younger or just don't have a strong grasp on the game's strategy. I'm not going to green someone because they just don't fully understand. Think about the kid on the other end. There's plenty of 10 or 11 or 12 year old kids that play this game that might not quite fully understand the strategy. These kids are sitting there experiencing other tunes essentially kicking them out of the game and ruining the game for them because of the reasons they don't even understand. This kid's just like, oh heck yeah, I finally get to fight the Cellbot boss, I can't wait to see what it's about. <laughs> There's a need for people to learn strategy, but kicking them out of the battle isn't the way to teach it. It only promotes more people that want to green other people later on, and it's the same thing with inviting only Hollywoods into VPs. People don't want to invite the small ones after being neglected the way they were back then. It gets to this point where now if you're a cold caller, you're just standing there with other cold callers like, please, please invite me. And the bigger Hollywoods and suits are like, ew lord no, get out of here and go train your cupcake noob. And he just don't listen to them and he just put pliz in a thought bubble. But that's neither here nor there. Greening to me is just ridiculous outside of the realm of greening someone that is greening others. Even that I probably wouldn't do myself. But if someone acts on it, I wouldn't necessarily stop them since at that point they're more than likely being completely uncooperative in the battle. I genuinely feel bad for people when they go sad, let alone actually choose to cause that on someone. I mean, I just recently helped with a charity stream and I let Fat Jimmy survive the Skelecog round with me. Granted, I had 60 people watching my every move and definitely not judging me, but the point is that I tried to help them through. I just want everyone to survive through a battle or a boss and I try my best to make sure that happens. Maybe I'm just a sweetie. No? No? Huh. Alright. Anyways, that's just my take on greening, and I don't think it's anything that I would ever agree with, and I actively choose to avoid it. So how do you guys deal with greening overall, and what else would you like to see me make a rant on? Let me know in the comments below. I also want to give a big shout out to Bingo Kemsky and Righteous Raikou for both supporting me so much this month on Patreon. It really means so much to me to see you guys go so far out of your way to support me and support my content each and every month. So I want to thank both of you very much for your contributions. It really means a lot to me. Thank you all for watching and I hope you enjoyed this video and more videos that I have to come. Do you like what you see? Wanna help me and make it? Ah, you thought I was gonna use the same Patreon outro as usual, didn't you? Look, 
Patreon.com. If you want to help support me and my content, you can pledge a certain amount, any amount you want monthly, and anything would go towards helping me create more content regularly, more often, every month for you guys. So thank you all for watching. If you support me, thank you so much, and I'll see you in my next video.